short time no see for us and the Porsche 911 GT3 Rs, after Auto Evolution got acquainted with the Stuttgart track hotshot last month in Geneva. Wondering what the Porsche 911 GT3 Rs is doing at Auto Shanghai 2015 since it already made a debut in Geneva? Well, enforcing Porsche's presence in China of course, and giving Chinese buyers an extra option for unlimited fun on the racetrack. Also, you should keep in mind that Porsche estimates China may pass the United States as the brand's largest market, which means Shanghai couldn't be neglected by the Stuttgart carmaker. So here we are, greeting the most powerful naturally aspirated engine the 911 family has ever seen. Nothing's changed in terms of performance, the GT3 Rs packs 500 HP and 450 New Mexico, 338 LB feet, courtesy of a 4.0, litter flat 6 beating heart sending its flow to a brand new and improved PDK dual clutch transmission. Despite the excitement you might feel by simply looking at that kinky wide body kit the Porsche 911 sports in Shanghai, we are reminded that engineers actually put the car on a diet before they allowed it to leave the factory. Sure. We enjoyed the time spent contemplating the massive rear wing but it's always nice to have a picture of what your circuit rivals get to see once you overpass them. Compared to the 911 GT3, the R's drop 10 kg and can blister through the 0 to 100 km per hour, 62 mph, interval in just 3.3 seconds. To make their track-oriented intentions clearer, Porsche fitted the 911 GT3 Rs with a paddle neutral function that acts emulates a depressed clutch as if the car had a manual gearbox. In addition, those willing to hit the circuit can now use the pit speed function, to limit the car's speed with a push of a button. Chinese buyers will have to deal with a starting price tag of 2,431,000 yuan, 391,830 dollars at current exchange rates, for Stuttgart circuit precision tool, but what's 1 or 2 million yuan when you get to own a 911 GT3 Rs?